Here we're looking down at a large number of plot encompasses and we've got a wire which is coming out perpendicular to the screen at this point in the middle. And at the moment there is no current in the wire, so all of the plot encompasses are pointing roughly north, though a few of them are magnetised the wrong way round. Now watch what happens when we turn on the current. And if you look carefully as the current slowly gets increased, the compasses all reorientate themselves and we can see that they're pointing round in a kind of circular shape and all of them forming circular loops, which is showing the magnetic field around a current carrying wire is circular. Now let's try sprinkling iron filings on whilst a large current is flowing through our wire and once again you can fairly soon see that we're getting the iron filings lining up in little circles, again showing that the magnetic field is circular around a current carrying wire. If you look carefully, you'll see that I've actually cheated slightly, because to get a strong enough magnetic field to show this clearly, you actually need a very large current through your wire. So rather than having a single wire, if you look carefully, I've actually made a coil of around 11 turns, and that means that I've still got current coming out perpendicular to the screen at this point here, but because I've got 11 turns and I'm passing about 5 amps through that, that's giving me about a total current of 55 amps, which is large enough to show a clear pattern with the plotting compasses and with the iron filings.